perhaps to Helen. Let's, let's hear something new. We understand about the Civil War site. If we have something new, present it. It's absolutely new. <laughs> Good. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for giving me. I'm only going to take about 120 seconds. Um, my property is the one in the far northeast corner. I'm the one who has the water problem. All the water drains give, in my give backyard. Give us your name, please, sir. My name is Michael Wardell, 2571 Garrison Commons, first Thank property you. on the left. I'm the one with the water problem. The water dumps into the pipe that sits underneath my property, that sits underneath my driveway. It's currently at about 29 years of its 30-year cycle. Whatever gets built up there is going to add approximately 400,000 gallons per every inch of rain when it comes into there. The pipe is at its at its end, it's in my backyard, something's going to have to be done, regardless of what is put in there. The other thing, too, is with the living arrangements, how it's going to be built, somebody can look into my children's bedrooms. There's only about a 50-foot setback. I have a problem with that. My daughter is eight and my son is not born yet. I don't want people being able to look into my home for obvious reasons. The last thing is the retention pond. The retention pond, if it be built, is going to house thousands of gallons of water that could have a snake problem, could have a Zika virus problem. There's a lot of things that can go wrong in that area. So I'm opposed to this completely and totally. And in spite of what some of my neighbors may think, I have not been paid or bribed or offered anything. I want that in the record because I've been hearing things in my neighborhood. That being said, I also want to state is, if they could come up with an alternate plan that would benefit both sides, I'd be willing to look at it. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your time.